Now, this has only been designed to introduce the concept of partials, really. But one question I do want to address is, when should one start using partials? Now, arguably, from day one, you could lift more weight from a higher position than you could from the floor. That's certainly physiologically true. The question is, should you? And I would argue you shouldn't. Um, first of all, you need to develop good technique with a conventional deadlift or from the ground before you start worrying about partials. Otherwise, if you practice too much at partial range, you may never get good deadlift technique from the ground. Secondly, your body needs time to adjust to handling the weight. Um, now, range is an important factor with this, but it's not the only one. Also, muscular strength is an important factor, but it's not the only one. I could quite conceivably come in off the street, never having done deadlift before, put some weights on the bar, lift it off the ground, and potentially my muscles are strong enough to take that. I'm not going to tear a muscle or something or other. However, the question is not simply whether my muscles are strong enough. It's also, is my connective tissue strong enough? Are my ligaments and tendons strong enough? Are my joints going to bear this? There's a lot of factors involved with lifting heavy weight other than simply muscle. When you use partials and put more weight on the bar, by default, the body is bearing more load. And the reason it can bear more load is because the range has been decreased. However, while that might make it easier, for example, you know, on my legs, lifting from here rather than here, okay, that may, might mean that, okay, my quadriceps and so on aren't coming under quite so much strain, therefore I can bear more weight. There's still an inescap inescapable fact that the weight on the bar is being borne by the back, the core, the shoulders, etc. And as I say, it's not simply muscles that are involved, joints, ligaments, tendons, connective tissue, the works are all involved there. If you start using partials too soon, the chances of you overloading one of those systems in the body are very high. So my rule of thumb is don't bother to introduce partials until you can deadlift off the floor between one and one and a half times your body weight. Okay, whatever your body weight might be, you know, if it's 60 kilos, in other words, if you can deadlift 60 to 90 kilos off the floor, one to one and a half times your body weight, then maybe it's time to start thinking about introducing some partials. If you're 100 kilos, 225 pounds, right? fine, when you can deadlift 100 to 150 kilos off the floor, then it's maybe it's time to start thinking about introducing partials. If you've been going to the gym for three or four weeks and you've got up to maybe 60-70% of your own body weight, don't stick a bar on some boxes or in a cage up high, slap on an extra 100 kilos and try lifting it, because your muscles may bear it, but the trouble is something else, connective tissue, ligament, tendon, etc., may not. You may or may not notice it at the time, you'd certainly notice it in the days following. The whole point to using any form of weight training exercise like this is progressive resistance, gradual improvement. You want to lift and then come back and lift a little bit more next time. You don't want to make such a massive jump that you end up risking injury. Basically, as I say, training safely is very important. So, for partials, simple rule of thumb, Introduce them when you can manage 100 to 150% body weight at deadlift off the ground, then go to partials. I do not suggest you try it before.